Hi, Gwyneth here on a fabulous Feel Good Friday. Now, if you're in the UK, I know you've been seeing very, very weird colours in the sky. Fortunately, here on my hill in Austria, it has been absolutely stunning, although it does look as though autumn has finally arrived and we're sitting in a cloud, but it's okay, life is still fabulous. This week, I've been talking a lot about how, how important it is actually to, to understand your personal brand vis-a-vis -vis your personality because I was fascinated earlier this week to see an interview with the artist previously known as Terence Trent Darby. You know the song, Sign, a, um, Sign Your Name Across My Heart? Absolutely loved that song. He had a fabulous voice back in the 80s, one of my you know pop icons really, and there was talk of him being as relevant to pop music as Prince and, and Michael Jackson, and then he just kind of disappeared, and I didn't really think about it. I thought, you know, now and again you hear this song on the radio, but you don't really think, well, whatever happened to him? So I was amazed, I was actually blown away to see this man, now called Sananda, on an interview, talking about why he decided to step away from the glitz and the glamour back in the 80s. So Sananda was, was talking about the fact that his personal brand, Terence Trent Darby, took on a life of its own. It became somebody or a thing that he was not inside. And he also talked about the fact, you know, many of his peers, many of his friends that he worked with in the 80s, they're all dead. And he said that had he not taken the choice to actually move away, that he would also be six feet under. Although I, I must say, he did say actually that, you know, it wasn't of his own, own volition. He would have liked to continue working because music is still today his absolute passion. But he knew that the personal branding aspect of it, the Terence Trent Darby and the story that went through that, that was crushing him. He has just released a new album, three CDs, and um, I've got the link to, um, to his homepage. He still has the most incredible voice. I, I can't tell you how happy I was to find out that he's still singing because he's just brilliant. So the moral of this story is that when you have your personal brand, when you are particularly working in business on your own, when you're a, a solopreneur or, or a business owner of a small business, and your personality is very strongly connected with the branding, with the image of what it is that you provide, your service, your product, there is a need to be very careful to ensure that your values still remain the same, that the image that you are promoting, the brand that is growing, is still in alignment with your personality, with the person that you are. If you liked Terence Trent Darby in the 80s, I highly recommend that you check out the link in this post and go and see what he's up to. He's absolutely amazing. I wish you a fabulous Feel Good Friday, a fabulous weekend, loads of love. Talk to you again soon and bye for now.